This is Credit Matters and I'm Greg Mosko. It's the Global Fixed Income Research Group. We expect $223 billion of Latin American debt, including the Caribbean, financial and non-financial corporate debt rated by S&P Global Ratings to mature through 2021. Of the total, $18 billion is scheduled to mature in 2016, $39 billion in 17, $40 billion in 18, $45 billion in 19, $42 billion in 20, and $38 billion in 2021. Financial companies account for 33% or 73 billion of Latin America's maturing debt, and 77% of their debt, or 56 billion, is rated investment grade, which is triple B minus or higher. Most debt, 150 billion or 67%, is from non-financial companies, and $79 billion, or 53% of this, is speculative grade. The amount of maturing debt at the lowest rating levels remains significant, and issuers with lower credit quality typically have less financial flexibility and tend to be more susceptible to refinancing risk in periods of credit market volatility. About $96 billion of speculative grade debt will mature from 2016 through 2021. A breakdown of sector risk reveals that approximately 35% of all Latin American rated debt maturing through 2021 is in the oil and gas sector where credit quality has been challenged by the fall in commodity prices over the past year. The oil and gas sector, including integrated oil and gas and exploration and production, has the largest amount of debt maturing through 2021 at $79 billion, and leads in non-financial speculative grade maturing debt with $44 billion, of which accounts 46% of all speculative grade maturing debt. When breaking out the oil and gas sector, the integrated segment has a higher speculative grade debt amount than exploration and production at $38 billion compared with $6 billion. The integrated oil and gas sector includes Petrobras, which was downgraded to single B plus from double B after Brazil's sovereign downgrade in the first quarter of 2016. Latin American countries with the largest share of maturing oil and gas debt include Brazil with 37% and Mexico with 25%. Only 12% of rated debt from the oil and gas sector is set to mature by 2017. This has been Credit Matters. Thank you for watching.